Hey everyone! I knew that many of you guys are already installed the iOS 17 beta version and experienced it for a while. This year, Apple may have put more focus on Vision Pro, so you may experience more bugs in iOS 17 beta 1 than usual. But don't worry, keep watching and I'll teach you 3 ways to downgrade your iOS 17 beta to iOS 16. Before we start, you'll need to have a few things ready. First, you'll need to make sure that your iPhone is backed up. You can do this by connecting your iPhone to your computer and using iTunes or Finder to back it up. Then we can sit back and relax and start downgrading. Method 1. Downgrade iOS 17 Beta with Tenorshare Reiboot This is an expert iOS system repair tool that can fix a variety of common iOS problems. What's more, it can also downgrade the iOS system. I've put the download link in the description. After downloading, connect your iPhone to your PC or Mac and then open Reiboot. On the home page, choose iOS Upgrade and Downgrade buttons. And choose Downgrade. Here you need to download the iOS 16 firmware to downgrade. Make sure your network environment is good and click Download. Next, click on the Initiating Downgrade option. Once you click the Continue button, Reiboot will begin to downgrade your iPhone back to iOS 16. This process could take a while, as iOS 17 and iOS 16 are two different generation systems. Now you can set up your iPhone again. If you have a backup of your data in iCloud, you can choose to restore it from iCloud. You can also start fresh by setting up your iPhone as a new device. Method 2. Downgrade iOS 17 Beta with iTunes To use iTunes, you'll need to download the iOS 16.5 IPSWA file. You can do this from Apple's website. Click iPhone and choose your iPhone model. Then download the iOS 16 file to your PC or Mac. Once you have the iOS 16.5 IPSWA file, plug your iPhone. Open your iTunes and press the Shift key while clicking the Restore iPhone option. Select the firmware you just downloaded and click Open. It says iTunes will erase and restore your phone to iOS 16. Choose the Restore button, then it will start to downgrade your iPhone to iOS 16. This will take a very long time, so I will skip it. Once the downgrade is OK, you will need to set up your iPhone again. Method 3. Downgrade iOS 17 Beta with Finder it's basically the same as downgrading with iTunes. Remember to go to ipswa.me to get the profile. Hold the Option key and click the Check for Update option. Select the file we just downloaded from ipswa.me. Then the downgrade will begin, wait for it. If you want to know how to restore backup from iTunes, you can watch our previous video. That's it. Hope this video is helpful to you. I will be grateful if you subscribe. See you soon.